Greetings from Brooklyn. I love New York and hello from Luna Park. This is Brooklyn's beach time fun and you can get here by taking the New York City subway, the D or the F train to the last stop or the first stop if you are a Coney Island Brooklyn resident and there is your subway entrance only two dollars and 75 cents from the Empire State Building and it takes about an hour to get here. Here is Jones Walk at Surf Avenue on a July summer evening as we walk up towards Dino's Wonder Wheel in Brooklyn. Summer fun. Now this has been featured in so many music videos and iconic images of summer in the city. Doesn't necessarily compete with the big theme amusement parks, but without a doubt, it has the charm for what New York City has to offer from just a subway ride away. And here's a guy in a Brooklyn shirt. Gotta say, love Brooklyn. Have my Coney Island shirt as well. You can actually buy Coney Island shirts in the subway terminal. That's the best place to get your shirts. Dining here as well. And let's walk up to Dino's Wonder Wheel, which is a bit interesting because it is not located in Luna Park. It has a space right here alongside of the beach, but it's not considered part of Luna Park. It has its own entity and it's part of New York City history. Celebrated its 100th year. Ah, look at New York history, Astroland Park. Luna Park at one point was referred to as Astroland. Now the Wonder Wheel is very interesting because you'll see if you're riding in a car, as the wheel turns, your car will move. And it's unlike any other uh, Ferris wheel that I've been on because you are really, you're thrown to the wind, your car moves around, and you can never really predict when you are going to be shuffled to your next location. A very unique Ferris wheel at that. And that's actually where you can get one of your great Coney Island photographs is at the Wonder Wheel. We'll walk up as close as we can. It reminds me of a bit of, of how much is for Dino's Wonder Wheel. Uh, it reminds me a bit of, uh, there is a beach in Ocean City. Oh, Nathan's. Nathan's, the original Nathan's hot dog exists here in Brooklyn, New York at Coney Island. It's Jolly Roger Amusement Park in Ocean City, Maryland. Uh, the vibe here reminds me of that. It's a waterside amusement park community. Not necessarily competing with theme parks, but having all of the rides and really, really fun. Now, if we can, we will walk back out to the boardwalk. Now, when season ends, the park doesn't necessarily close shop. They have a Halloween parade uh, for kids. Coney Island. But the first weekend of the summer is the Mermaid Parade. And that's when the mermaids come out of the Atlantic Ocean onto land. Quite amazing. And again, the original Nathan's founded by Polish immigrants is here. And there's a great history of the hot dog. And there is the hot dog eating contest that takes place here at Nathan's. And you could be a Nathan's owner. You can buy shares of Nathan's uh, in the stock market. And you can always be connected to the success and the well-being of this ever fun community, uh, which is something, yeah, I chose to do that after really having so much fun here in I Love New York. What's this one about? Dino's Wonder Wheel. It's a history tour, something that you can visit for the history of New York. And we'll walk over to the boardwalk while highlighting the Coney Island History Project. 
Now the doors are closed right now. Actually, the metal gates are closed right now. I have walked up and it actually looks like one of the games in Luna Park. They have everything set up behind glass and they have some of the original posters for the mermaid parade and very enthusiastic employees that can answer questions to you about some of the history of Coney Island, Luna Park. I think of the name as Astroland, but it's currently called Luna Park. Now you can see some of these rides from other boroughs. When you are at the beach in the uh, borough of Queens, you can clearly see Coney Island. And from the tip of Breezy Point, you have a great view of the Coney Island Friday night fireworks. Now here is Nathan's. That is not the original Nathan's, but if you want to have your hot dog right on the beach, so be it. And that is a structure that you can see uh, from other boroughs. This is not Coney Island Boardwalk. It's referred to as the Regalman Boardwalk. And this is where you will view the Friday night fireworks. And now we'll walk, oh, I love his Brooklyn shirt. Fashion snob, love my Brooklyn clothes. And here is a look of the beach. So that's how close the amusement park, Cyclone Roller Coaster, Luna Park is to Coney Island. There is a newer addition that is the boardwalk in this area is where you can stay on the beach on Friday nights for the fireworks display. And that is a walk through on a July summer evening of Coney Island, Brooklyn, New York. Till next time, happy summer. Remember beautiful, I love New York.